I transferred to a new school in the spring of my second year of high school. I'm Haruto Suchiha. I look forward to meeting all of you. Haruto, please take a seat next to Nagisa over there. Okay. That's the new student? Yeah, I heard he's very poor and moved into a rundown house with very low rent. I don't mind that kind of chit chat. It's true that my family's poor. It's much more troublesome to stand out by rebelling against it. Oh. Um, Nagisa-san, right? Nice to meet you. Uh, uh, yeah. Huh? Maybe she doesn't like me. During lunch break that day... Haruto, can I talk to you? Uh, huh? I have something important to tell you. Can you come to the roof for a minute? Um, what's this important business? I'll head up there now and wait for you. Oh, hey! Hey, wait up, transfer student! What? Why is she talking to a poor guy like you? She's everyone's dream girl! I, I have no idea. I didn't know Nagisa-san had such high status in our class. I thought she was cute for sure, but... If you want to talk to Nagisa-chan, you must first join her fan club, which we run! Join? That sounds like some kind of weird religion. It's $10 for a five minute conversation. Is this some kind of vicious business that preys on the poor? Okay. Nagisa John is gonna be my girlfriend sooner or later, so you'd better back off. What? There's no way you can get her to fall for you. What the heck? Well then, I'll be off. On the school rooftop. <laughs> that was bad. I almost became their punching bag. <sighs> You're here! Uh, Nagisa-san! Please, can you let me stay like this for a while? What's going on? Does she... like... me? Should I respond romantically here? Five minutes later... Well... Can I go now? Just a little longer. It's been five minutes already! Is that so? I really want to keep doing this, but... I can't keep doing this! It's playing with my emotions! You don't have much in your life, so I want to give you a little something. A little bit of what? Oh my gosh! What am I supposed to do? Phew! Thank you so much. That made me very happy. But... I didn't do anything! What the heck just happened? If it's not too much trouble, I'd love to meet you here again tomorrow. Huh? Is she not listening to me when I speak? Well then... What was that about? I'm so caught up on what happened earlier. Oh, I can't concentrate on the class! Hey... Nagisa-san, about what happened earlier. No private conversations in class. Uh, what? After all that hugging, she's suddenly cold towards me? I'd love it if she'd just choose to be either cold or gentle. At lunch break the next day... Oh, you're here! Well, yeah. How can I not be curious when she acts as she did? I don't want anything from her except to know what she's thinking. Since no one else is up here, let's get right to it. Wait a minute! Why? Why are you doing this? I can't keep doing this until you tell me why. Well, it's cause... cause I love it! Uh, huh? Do you need any more reasons? Uh, no, that's... No, if you don't mind. I feel calm when I'm like this. Calm? I don't feel calm at all. Should I hug her back? Or should I just let her hug me? On another day... I'm afraid I no longer feel comfortable with this situation. I've never even had a girlfriend before. 
How am I supposed to go home and face my parents after doing this during my lunch break? Um... Can I ask you something? Do you hug me just because you want to feel the warmth of another person? Hmm... I do it to recharge my batteries. Recharge? You fill me with life every day. Something like that. Hmm... <laughs> nah, it's not like... <laughs> I feel like I'm in heaven every day being hugged by this pretty girl. Hmm. Thank you again for today. I look forward to doing it again. She always looks so happy after our hugs. Oh, did someone spill something over you while you were at work yesterday? Uh, yeah, a customer spilled some ramen on me. Why? You're a little different than usual. Huh? Did I tell her that I worked part-time at a ramen restaurant? Today is finally over. Oh, Nagisa-san. If you want to walk home with me today... Minami, would you like to walk home with me today? Sure. Hmm. She's still avoiding me as usual. She'll speak to me at lunchtime, but won't even make eye contact with me in the classroom. Hey, Haruto! Did you just try and ask out Nagisa-san on an after-school date? You can't trick us! These guys again? They're so persistent! You're on our blacklist! You can consider all the boys in this high school to be your enemies from now on! I just transferred to the school a week ago! Please, be nice to me! Don't worry! We're on your side! You can call us your best friends, okay? Huh? Currently, you're the one who talks to Nagisa-san most in our class. In other words, if I stay on good terms with you, I might be able to steal her away from you someday. What on earth? I was an idiot for thinking he was being nice to me. Tell me more about the incident on the roof the other day. There's no way you guys are dating, are you? If you were, we'd have to report it to the Haruto Suchiha Eradication Committee. You guys just made that group up, didn't you? But you can rest assured that I'm not dating her. That's for sure. <sighs> That's good. Do you want to go get some ramen with me? I'll buy it for you. If you buy it for me, then yeah, I'll come. I think you're asking for too much. Nagisa-san and I aren't dating. Are we? Oh, what kind of relationship do we have? Then... Nagisa-san, let's not do this anymore. What? I honestly don't know what's going through your head. Hugging me every day and then ignoring me. But... but... If you're looking for a hug pillow, ask some of the guys from your fan club. They'll do anything for you. Wait a minute! How much money do you want? It's not about money. Put your wallet away. Well, let's see. I'll make you one side dish every day for lunch. I'm not in elementary school. <laughs> well, then I'll do whatever you want, Haruto-kun. You sound crazy. Are you okay? <sighs> Why are you so obsessed with me? There are plenty of guys who will do whatever you want. It was a small thing that made me like you, Haruto-kun. But as I was stalking you, my feelings for you deepened. I see. Uh, what did you just say? You work part-time every day to make ends meet. It's very admirable that you do the housework for your younger siblings, too. Thanks for that. Once I got to know you like that, I didn't want to be with anyone else. That's how she knew that I worked part-time at a ramen restaurant? Then... Why are you so cold to me when we're in class? It's just that... I'm embarrassed to talk to you in front of everyone. Huh? But why? Because it's embarrassing! I'll collapse in shame if someone starts a rumor and makes fun of me. Oh... So you're just a shy person. What do you think? 
Will you let me keep hugging you? Uh, I feel like it's impossible to continue our relationship anyway. Two classmates hugging each other on the roof every day is abnormal no matter how you look at it. So, is this... Please, go out with me! What? If we're lovers, it's not strange to hug each other, right? I think the teacher will be angry if we hug each other in class. I don't care. But if I get to be your girlfriend, it doesn't matter if the teacher gets mad at me. That's how I got my first ever girlfriend. Oh, uh, I forgot to ask you something. Is it my three body measurements? Ah, uh, <laughs> such a prankster. Well, why am I the one you're hugging? What? Last time, you said it was something small, but there are better looking and better educated people in our class than me, right? The... the smell. The... smell? I love my father, and I used to sleep with him when I was little. You smell just like him. <laughs> what? My smell? But now he's always away on business trips overseas so I don't get to see him as much as I used to. Sorry, but I don't have a bath in my house. And I can't go to the public onsen every day. Don't be sorry, it's better. I like your thick smell, Haruto-kun. Wow, my smell excites her that much? And I smell just like your father? Oh, thank you. I'm happy to hear you say that. Oh. What's wrong? My dad sent me a text message. He sent me a picture, too. Wanna see it? Oh. Let's see it. Nagisa-san's father. He must be very handsome. Ta-da! Look at him. He's cool, isn't he? Yeah! Whoa! So, what does he do? Oh, he's a rare animal hunter. That's why he always goes overseas. Whenever he comes back to Japan, he always smells of the rare animals that he hunts. And I love it. Uh, I, I, I'm sorry. I'm going to the public bath right now. My first girlfriend is quirky and super cute. But I think I'll be going to the public bath to take a bath every day from now on. Even if I'm poor. <laughs> <laughs>